Hey guys, what's up? Chris here for BeerGeekNation.com. Today, super excited about this beer. One of my favorite beers of all time, St. Bernardus 12, an absolutely fantastic Abbey style quad. Um, as far as I'm concerned, it's better than Westy 12. It's actually the original Westy 12 uh, recipe before they switch to the current re recipe. It's very convoluted. World War II got involved and recipes got confused, but Nonetheless, this beer is readily available. The trick to this one is it's oak aged. Oak aged in uh, Calvados barrels, from what I understand, for six months. Um, I picked this one up at belgianinabox.com. You can go there, get all these crazy Belgian beers and have them shipped directly to you. Very, very cool stuff. So I'm super excited about this one. Always wanted to try this, just it doesn't get to the US too much. So I'm really glad I'm getting to try it. With that said, coming in 11% alcohol by volume. Let me get a glass that you guys know it smells, tastes. Give you the final verdict on the Oak Aged St. Bernardist Op 12. All right, guys, so the aroma. Yeah, immediately a big dark cherries, red wine type of characteristics, a little bit of vanilla in there. Incredibly, incredibly big kind of prune, raisin characteristics, some breadiness in there. It just smells awesome. All right, guys, the taste. Cheers. Oh, yeah. Really, really nice. Classic St. Bernardus. Right at the front of the tongue, sweetness, raisins, fig, plum, middle of the mouth, big kind of juicy dark fruit notes. Again, that, that plum and fig and raisin coming through. Definitely getting some of the barrel. Calvados, I believe, is a port wine. I could be wrong on that. I actually forget what it is. Um, but you're definitely getting like a big kind of red wine-ish type of character, a juiciness. Definitely getting some vanilla, a little bit of a tannic quality in there as well. The barrel is pretty subtle, but this is a fairly intense beer, so that doesn't surprise me too much. Sweet in the aftertaste. More dark fruits, like cinnamon coated dark fruits, a little bit of that woodiness coming in through back back there. It's that's I mean that's what it is. It's St. Bernardus 12 with some oak to it. It's awesome stuff. All right, guys, so the final verdict on the St. Bernardus at 12, oak aged, 11% alcohol by volume. You can pick this one up at belgiuminabox.com. Uh, guys, going to give this one an A. It's, it's fantastic stuff. Again, one of my favorite quads of all time. And then it's, I will say the barrel isn't like aggressive. It's not too in your face. It's more of a subtlety. Definitely bringing the beer, come, accentuating some of the flavors in the beer, some of the sweetness, some of the dark fruits. Uh, you're getting like that red wine-ish characteristic, a little bit of tannic quality, some vanilla in there as well. Um, it definitely highlights some of the other aspects of the beer and it doesn't overwhelm by any means. Really, really nice stuff. If you do get to try it, definitely pick yourself up a bottle. Getting an A for me, remember folks, I do short. Drink crazy beers. Thanks so much.